Greetings from Washington, D.C. I'm David Ferriero, archivist of the United States. Beverly, Massachusetts is my hometown. It's the birthplace of the U.S. Navy. As a former Navy corpsman, this makes me incredibly proud. But today I want to talk about a lesser known story of my hometown. We had the first cotton mill that was built in America, Beverly Cotton Manufactory. It used experimental techniques and machinery. At the time, it was the largest mill in the country, and in 1789, George Washington came to visit it. He was impressed with its state-of-the-art machinery and the use of horsepower. He remarked about this mill in his diary. He wrote, after passing Beverly two miles, we came to the cotton manufactory, which seems to be carrying on with spirit by Mr. Cabot, principally. In this manufactory, they have the new invented carding and spinning machines. One of the first supplies the work, and four of the latter, one of which spins 84 threads at a time by one person. In short, the whole seemed perfect, and the cotton stuffs which they turn out excellent of their kind. Warp and filling both are now of cotton. Because of this mill, Beverly has also been called the birthplace of the American Industrial Revolution. You can find George Washington's diary entry on Founders Online a searchable website hosted by the National Archives through the National Historical Publications and Records Commission. Founders Online has transcriptions of thousands of documents written by and to the nation's founders. The National Archives is pleased to join the Honor Your Hometown celebration.